Oh my god, Ronnie. Hey gamers, welcome back to Is It That Game, your one-stop destination for the best Android and iOS games out there. I'm your friend Big Smoke, and this is the second part of Top 10 Big Android and iOS Games which are just like the PC games. Gone are the days when the best game on mobile was none other than the 2D food-eating snake. Nowadays, Android and iOS phones cram a lot of power on their own, and with projects like xCloud and Google Stadia, smartphones are constantly being pushed to their limits. Today, I'll walk you through some of the most graphically enhanced games that can be natively played on smartphones. But before we get going, let me introduce you to today's sponsor, Raid Shadow Legends. I know you've already heard about Raid everywhere, but there's a great reason for it. Raid is one of the top three ranked RPGs on the Google Play Store, and it's just been nominated as a finalist for Google Play's Best of 2019 User's Choice Award. The game is crazy popular, and with almost 15 million downloads in the last six months alone. So what is Raid? It's an epic dark fantasy done right, a hero collection turn-based game with over 400 champions for you to collect and personally customize. Here, you can assemble a team from 16 heroic factions, explore over 1 million champion builds, and claim your glory in the PvP arena. And the best part, it is free to play. Some extra cool features in the game include new champions every month, and I am talking about an insane 16 champions a month with a cool progressive reward system. And what's fresh? Once you complete the missions, you will get one of the best legendary champions in the game, the Arbiter. The game is growing super fast, and you can clearly notice that in this cool roadmap that they've published. You can find me in the game under the nickname Is It That Game, and if you're quick enough, you can also join my clan. So what are you waiting for? Go to the video description, click on the special links, and you will get 50,000 silver and a free epic champion as part of the new player program to start your journey. See you in the game! And now, here we go again! First up on our list we have Retract Battle Royale, a high-octane FPS with gorgeous graphics and immersive gameplay. This 802 megabyte game developed by Hoodoo Studios is currently in early access, but already looks very promising. There are no pay-to-win mechanics here, and the gameplay is entirely skill-based, so forget about things like auto-aim. Similar to other Battle Royale titles like PUBG, Retract is a very realistic FPS that requires a lot of practice. Once you do get good at it, however, expect the game to be very rewarding. Next up we have Left to Survive, a zombie-themed 762 megabyte shooter developed by MyCom. The game pits you against hordes of zombies in action-packed battles that take place across a sprawling urban landscape. Once you've honed your skills against the undead, it's time to jump into the real challenge. Left to Survive features intense PvP battles where you can test your mettle in 1 vs 1 duels or 2 vs 2 team matches. If you're the cooperative type, you can instead join forces with other players and fight off the zombies together. And next on our list, we have the indie phenomenon that broke the internet last year with its quirky and punishing gameplay. We're talking, of course, about getting over it. If you've never heard about this one-man project developed by Bennett Foddy, you've been missing out. The basic gist is that you play as a guy stuck in a pot who has to climb a steep mountain using nothing but a hammer. Sounds weird, I know, but that's what makes it so fun. It only weighs 190 megabytes, so go check it out. Ladies and gentlemen, start your engines, because the next game on our list is Need for Speed No Limits. This popular racing title was developed by Electronic Arts, with the same tried and true formula used by its PC counterparts. This game is all about driving fast and customizing your rides with sweet components provided by top manufacturers like Ferrari, Lamborghini and more. No Limits features over 1,000 challenging races and plenty of maps to keep you busy for a very long time. The game takes up 1.8 gigabytes of space, but you'll definitely want to make room for this one. Moving on, we have a very impressive looking FPS known as Modern Combat 5. The latest installment in the long-running franchise developed by Gameloft, Modern Combat 5 weighs 1.6 gigabytes and is truly a sight to behold on mobile. The game features an immersive fast-paced single-player campaign where you can choose between nine classes, each with its own unique set of skills. If you are up for it, you can then challenge other players in intense online battles and even participate in esports tournaments for a chance to win big money. 
And next up on our list, we have one of the best puzzle platformers of all time, in the form of Playdead's Limbo. Limbo only takes up 136 megabytes of space, but don't let its small size fool you, because this little game is an absolute masterpiece. Limbo takes place in a dark and surreal world, where you play as a little boy trying to find his sister. Although the puzzles are absolutely fantastic, it's the silhouette graphics and eerie atmosphere that truly set Limbo apart from other puzzle games. Next up, we have Gangstar Vegas, a 2GB open-world action shooter developed by Gameloft. If you watched part 1 of this series, you might remember that we covered another game in this franchise, Gangstar New Orleans. Gangstar Vegas is the prequel to New Orleans and features very similar GTA-inspired gameplay. This time around, you take on the role of Jason Malone, an MMA fighter who must brawl and race his way across the streets of Las Vegas while fleeing from the Mafia. Do you have what it takes to complete all 80 missions and become a real gangstar? Now join me as we take a trip back in time to one of my favorite third-person shooters of the early 2000s, Max Payne. Don't worry about its age though, because Max Payne Mobile is a remake of the original that was developed by Rockstar Games, specifically for modern Android and iOS devices. Back in the day, this game popularized the concept of cinematic storytelling. Max Payne was also one of the first shooters to use bullet-time gameplay mechanics, inspired by The Matrix. The game takes up a hefty 1.8 gigabytes of storage, but it's totally worth it. Next up on our list is a game that needs very little introduction, because you've probably seen ads for it everywhere by now. Dungeon Hunter 5 is a highly complex hack-and-slash RPG developed by Gameloft. This massive 3GB title features some of the best graphics currently available on mobile. Customize your character with hundreds of pieces of gear and wreak havoc on the battlefield with tons of devastating powers. Go at it alone in single player or team up with up to three friends and explore this dangerous but beautiful world together. We already talked about a couple of Battle Royale games in part 1 of this series and earlier in this episode, but now it's time to go back to the title that popularized the genre in the first place. We're talking of course about PUBG. PUBG Mobile is the quintessential Battle Royale experience where you start off with nothing but your bare fists and try to make your way to the top by whatever means necessary. The prize? Prestige, bragging rights and of course that sweet, sweet chicken dinner. PUBG Mobile is developed by Tencent and weighs 2.4 gigabytes. So that's all for today guys, do let me know if I missed your favorite game and I'll pin it as the top comment. To watch 10 more smartphone games, same as PC games, click the video on the left and don't forget to press the bell icon after you subscribe. Hope you enjoyed the video, see you in the next one. Till then this is your friend Big Smoke, signing off.